Uh, our fundraising goal is to raise about $3,000 for state competition that will help pay for the students' uh, hotel room, food, so they don't have to pay for anything. And um, our, our uh, time frame is before May 7th, which is our competition. In my class, we teach about the three Ds of STEM. And I call it design, drones, and 3D printing. So welcome to the new classroom in middle school where creativity and discovery are welcomed. It has to do with jobs, jobs, and more jobs. That's the whole point, is having a flow of education coming through. That is, flow of education starts in the grade schools, and especially now the middle schools, we already have in the high schools. One of the things we have now is we're trying to see if we can get the uh, robotics arena, a temporary one, up here in Crestview until a full-scale one can be obtained by the county in that process. So Now, I don't want you to get too excited, but if you have a major, a major contest here of the, all, all, all the groups of the robotics, you, you could be talking about five to 10,000 tourists coming here for the... These are huge programs. This is big impact kind of stuff. So hopefully the county is going to be able to put together a game plan to get a full-scale arena out there so we can keep keep pushing these kinds of tech programs through here. We can't bring in good paying jobs if we don't have a good educational system that has the right kind of flow rate going to it. So the CTAP is all part of that, all part of that process as well. 